Hello, and welcome to Visions Art Museum. My name is Laura Mitchell, and I am the museum's director. I'm delighted to welcome you today to Of Meadows and Blue Skies, an installation by Melody Money. Your docent today will be Carol Sebastian Neely, who was the volunteer curator for this show. I hope you enjoy the tour. And don't forget to check out our website, www.visionsartmuseum.org. And thank you for being here. Welcome to our Valia Gallery, home to Melody Money's exhibition of Meadows and Blue Skies, which will grace this space from July 18th through October 4th. This gallery is the perfect spot to have an exhibit which celebrates Melody's love of the meadows and blue skies of her Colorado homeland. My name is Carol Sebastian Neely, Melody's volunteer curator and a big fan of her work. Mel characterizes herself as a mixed media textile artist. She began her art studies at the University of Colorado, concentrating on silk screen. She continued her studies at Rudolf Schaefer School of Design in San Francisco, where she studied prismatic color theory and design. Her work is a labor of love of details and the effects of light, celebrating everyday moments and memories. Her work has also been shown at such venues as the National Textile Museum in Washington, D.C., as well as internationally. Here in the Valia, Melody Money recreates the constantly changing landscapes of the meadows near her home. Through the changing seasons and hours of the day, she tracks variations in color and light. For Melody, these works are calculated documentations of her impressions. She makes constant use of a sketchbook to record them. In Melody's artist statement, she writes, For me, what makes a piece of art sing is a combination of the details and the quality of the light. I try to shine a light on everyday moments. The wind through the grass, birds in flight, the way the light makes snow shimmer, light reflected on the water, and the musicality of starlight are all images full of radiance. As the 15 swallows fly acrobatically overhead, we are immediately immersed in money's meadow with sky prayers between the sun and the moon on the large wall ahead. Hopes, dreams, and prayers rise up to fill the skies seen here at dawn, dusk, and evening. A very large triptych, 49 inches high by 103 inches wide, it is composed of recycled silk sari ribbon and trim, hand-painted cotton gradient fabric, cotton, silk, and rayon fabric, hand dyed silk organza, vintage embroidered buttons, crystals, carved mother of pearl, and carved bone. Melody has hand painted cotton gradient fabric. She has folded, pleated, and manipulated fabric, machine embroidered and quilted, but also hand embroidered. Immediately to the left of Sky Prayers, we come upon Rain, another large piece of 69 inches high by 69 inches wide. Melody was inspired by the sound of rain. She wanted to visually show how it sounds. There are several blue sky folded prairie points to remind us that there is a blue sky behind the clouds more use of recycled silk sari ribbon and trim, silk, cotton, and rayon, beads, buttons, sequins, and mirrors, hand-painted silk habitai, felt backing, and cotton backing. 
field studies is 48 inches high by 28 and a half inches wide, is itself a sketchbook of the artist's rambles through nature. She has recreated the creatures from the meadows as one might sketch the details of a collected specimen. Melody hoped that together these sketches would form for the viewer an idea of a day in the meadow. In this piece, Melody made use of photo transfer onto silk and gauze and leaf prints, along with beads, sequins, and vintage carved bone. Vintage millinery supplies were added, plus worn, frayed, and recycled denim some hand-painted cotton and commercially printed cotton, and felt, various yarns and embroidery thread, silk sari ribbon, hand-painted silk, plus vintage kimono fabric pieces. In Colorado, the skyscape is always changing from moment to moment. For Blue Sky Theory, Melody combined many photos taken on multiple days to form an idea of endless blue sky days. Look closely for worn, frayed, and recycled denim, photo transfer on silk, cotton, and gauze, hand painting, and her trademark hand embroidery. For tall grass daydreams, Melody was inspired by the way the wind plays with the tall grasses in a nearby meadow. A wonderful sight. The patterns are ever changing like waves on the ocean. Melody Money is most excited by the tiny complicated details in her work details which come together to realize the essence of a single moment. In the diptych, Meadow 1 and Meadow 2, we are enveloped in an endless meadow under an endless sky. The thousands of hand-wrapped threads in these pieces are produced very slowly, with minute attention to the building of color and value. Melody Money's work is a meditative process, taking months. The journey for her is as important as the finished piece. In Pieces of Sky, Melody celebrated a hike in Rocky Mountain National Park where the lake fades into the marshlands. She wanted to portray that view and how the sky is reflected into the seemingly endless marshlands. For this piece, she used hand-dyed silk organza, sheer metallic organza, and hand-painted cotton fabric, some bits of silk velvet. She has a felt backing and cotton backing on this piece. In the Japanese practice of kintsugi, a broken item is repaired with gold. This new glittering aspect makes the object even more beautiful in its flawed state. Money has joined the structured grid of one side to the flowing curves of the other in the moment in between with a stream of golden embroidery thread. The white triangles represent birds in flight, echoing the swallows flying overhead. Melody writes, there is a meadow near my home. I never tire of watching the wind play through the tall grasses. The grasses change throughout the seasons from an electric green in spring to the soft yellows of autumn and the predominant white of winter. This piece is portraying the grasses in high summer, just as the greens of summer are giving way to fall. The way the wind sings through the grasses sounds 
to melody like a low chant. And so she created this piece, which she named Chant, hand painting cotton and hand dyeing silk organza. Plus, she added more of the hand embroidery and embellishment for which she is known. Looking above, we see 15 swallows in flight. Sometimes in late spring or early summer, Melody shares that there are flocks of swallows around her house. Their acrobatic flights are a wonder to watch, and the thrill of their daring moves is heart-stopping. The last words of this tour belong to Melody Money. I love the process of many details coming together to form an essence of a place and time. The journey is as important as the finished piece. I am motivated to take a medium that is traditionally worked in a smaller scale and expand it to a larger vision. I welcome the opportunity to go over the top with detail. The use of textiles has enabled me to incorporate texture into my paintings. The fabric softens the edges and warms the final piece, but mostly for me, it is about the shimmer of the light. I try to capture that moment of grace when the angle of the light will resonate. I want to celebrate the quiet loveliness of everyday moments.